Aloha, hi everybody, it's Rasha. It is 52 weeks post gastric sleeve surgery for me. Last week I came to you from the gym in my workout gear with my awesome friend Amber Sweeney and my trainer Martha from Primal Instinct Fitness and this week I am coming to you in my wedding dress. <laughs> it's my surgiversary. It's April 24th, 2014 and exactly one year ago today I had my gastric sleeve surgery. And the only thing that I own in my entire house that I kept or held on to from my bigger clothes was my wedding dress. My wife and I have been married, it'll be four years in August, and I wore this when I was 260 some odd pounds, but at my highest I was actually 288 pounds. So I just kind of wanted to show what it looks like to be in this dress. It's really big, it's gargantuous, but of course I have to keep it, it's my wedding dress. So, I'm gonna take it off, so don't mind me, I might have to have my wife help me if I can't get it over my head, because I do wanna warn you guys, I'm gonna show you lots of body parts right now, nothing naked, but I want you to see how far I've come in a year. So, I might need you. Uh, I'm gonna see if I can figure this out. You're, you think this is funny, you're just whack. Okay. I'm okay, don't worry about me. Whack, you totally gotta to help me. Anyway, is my hair okay? You can say yes or no. Yes. Okay, thanks. Anyway, hi guys. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so this is what I look like. My body and all, no plastic surgery, nothing like that, and I love my body. I love my body now. I loved it when I was 288 pounds. I'm actually 160 pounds. So a year ago, I actually weighed 270 pounds a day after surgery, and I'm 160 now. So I am down 110 pounds in the past year, and I think I'm doing relatively well considering that I've lost so much weight in the past year. I, at my highest, I was 288, and now being 160, that's, what, we did the math, 128, 128 pounds overall from my highest. And I'm not ashamed of my body. I wasn't ashamed when I was 288 either. But I wanna show how hard I've worked to get where I am. I don't want plastic surgery. I don't want any of that. That's why I hired a personal trainer. And I work my okole or butt off and I'm gonna to have to work it off for the rest of my life. I have to continue, even though I'm a year post gastric sleeve surgery, that was only a tool. I have to be healthy and fit for my wife, for myself, for our daughter. And I wanna thank all of you for going on this journey with me. I don't think I'm done yet. I think that I'm gonna keep blogging, whether it's about gastric sleeve surgery or you know, endeavors or different things that are happening in mine and my family's lives. I mean, all almost 900 of you have been on this journey with me for the past year and I humbly thank you for being here and I'm just gonna keep going. I'm not gonna, hopefully, not gonna keep losing. I just want to maintain you know, this healthy, fit lifestyle and be super, super strong. So now I want to tone all of this up. I just want to get really, really fit and really, really strong. And I want to tell all of you that are considering gastric sleeve surgery, it's not easy. It's a decision that you have to make for yourself and for your family and for your health, but you have to work your ass off. And that is what I'm going to continue to do for the rest of my life to make this a permanent tool to help me be happy and healthy forever. So again, it's Rasha's gastric sleeve surgery blog. It's one year post surgery for me. Thank you to everyone at Oregon Weight Loss Surgery. You can check out my full bio on OregonWeightLossSurgery.com. You can check out my wife and I's new endeavor at DapperDFashions.com and Facebook.com slash DapperDFashions and on Twitter too. And thank you. I humbly, humbly thank you for coming on this journey and please reach out to me and I will try to answer all of you back. I get a lot of messages every day and I'm sorry I'm really busy, but I will try to answer all of you. So thank you for all you do. Go after your dreams. Anything is possible. Mwah, mwah, mwah. Aloha.